Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the video. Now, Driving Empire has just released a huge game-changing teaser. Now, this teaser is definitely super cool, and we're gonna look at it in depth, go over everything, so you're gonna wanna stick around till the end of this video. All right, so heading over to the Driving Empire Discord, we can see a new message has been sent by the community manager, Nick. He says, soon you will have the option to apply different front rims and different rear rims. Update coming soon, stay tuned. And at first, this image doesn't look too, you know, crazy, nothing too crazy from it. But if we take a deeper look, we can start to see how big this update could be. And we don't even know everything that's coming in this update. All we know is there's a big update coming and this is part of it. So if you can see um, right next to my head right here, I'll try to like, here, let me try to scoot over for you all. Um, right here, basically, new rim UI next to me. It says all, for, oh wait, am I pointing the right way here? All front and then rear and custom color. So. Basically, you can change all your rims at once, just the front rims or just the rear rims if you want. And obviously, you can still change the color. But this is all new UI we've never seen before. Also, if you look at the background, basically, we can see this is some kind of new place of the map. Maybe a new customization shop. Maybe you'll go through a little cutscene when entering to the customization garage and it will take you to this place, kind of like Drive World. Um, but yeah, basically, what I'm saying is this is a totally new customization UI and shop. So. Very cool. We can see we got new back button right there. That's new. The money UI looks different. Um, and then the rims UI down here. This is really different. So we can see we got new UI for all the rims that you'll be able to purchase right here. Uh, and I and you can see uh, you can have these arrows to you know go back and forth. So oh whoops I clicked off the wall. These aren't all basically. These aren't all the rims you can choose from. If you click through, there'll be definitely way more options. They might even add some new rims, but right now we already have tons of rims in the game. But also, if you haven't noticed already, this is a new car that isn't in the game. Now, I believe this is the Nissan S15 or S14 JDM fanboys. Don't get mad at me if I got that one wrong. I'm sorry, I'm not the biggest JDM fan, but I believe that's what this car is. And this is a fake model of it, but this one looks so good. Like, I can barely tell this is a fake model. Like, this is actually super close to the real car, in my opinion. Like. The rims look pretty good. You can tell by the body shape. Only noticeable difference is whatever this like little side vent thing is. And I believe the front bumper's been changed up a bit. But like besides that, I mean, come on. This is a pretty good looking fake model in my opinion. It looks pretty realistic. So yeah, I mean, looks like this game's starting to turn itself around. I know we've gone through like a bumpy um, car removal, you know, rough time, but Hey, now it looks like they're getting back at it with some groundbreaking updates, such as this one. You know, I know some games have stuff like this, but still, you know, maybe this game's gonna make a recovery and come back with um, some really good updates. This is just the start, obviously. We'll see some more teasers soon for what Driving Empire is gonna add, but I believe that's everything for today's video. So drop a like if you enjoyed it, I would truly appreciate it. Make sure you subscribe, ring that notification bell so you never miss another upload, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace.